Okay, so this is the Sugita head frame. I'm gonna show you guys how to put it together to have it ready for the surgeon to use, okay? Why they're gonna use this is sometimes if they want to um, attach this onto the Sugita frame so that they can just rest their hands on it and not move. So you're gonna need this. And in here, there's these two blocks. Okay, and uh, you may or may not need this one, but I'm gonna go over putting it together. And then you need this wrench. From this box here, you're gonna take these pins. You're gonna take three of them and you're gonna put them on your shave prep tray. They don't need to be sterile. Instead of pinning the patient, we're putting this into the frame and I'll show you guys that in a bit. I'll show you the frame after. So you're gonna take them, put them on the shave prep tray. Okay, what you need to put these together are in this little area here. There's a lot of stuff in this box that you're not going to need. So to put these casting gear mechanisms onto your frame, you're gonna use uh, these pins here. If you can see, they're slightly longer than these. So you're gonna take it. You can hand tighten to begin with both sides so if you see how the frame comes outside on one side and from the inside on the other but you pin from the outside for both so go ahead and tighten and then we're going to take the wrench just to secure it nice and tight always have the wrench up too because if the surgeon wants to lower it then he'll take the wrench to do that all right, so just to give myself some extra room, I'll just move this out. So surgeon might want to use this here. So how you're going to affix this is we'll go back to our little thing here. Same kind of pins and your uh, little semicircular frame here fits on the outside. And then go ahead and hand tighten and just make sure you're not stripping the uh, screw when you're putting it in there and now we'll go from that side that one's a little bit harder to do but it it still works so i'm going to go ahead and fully tighten this one this one like i said i'm going to have it looked at but it, it's a bit harder but just do it until everything's nice and secure it seems to be going now Okay, everything's nice and tight, and that's it. That's all you should have to do to get this, the surgeon ready. Uh, ask them if they're gonna use this. If not, you're just getting this bottom piece ready. I'm gonna show you what it looks like on the frame, okay? So we're gonna take it. So imagine you, we're all sterile now, your patient's head here. What the surgeon's gonna do is he's gonna grab it, and it, he's gonna put it here. Then he's gonna take the wrench. And doo -doo -doo, I think it's this one here. He's just going to tighten that up. Okay, so that's nice and tight. And now he can operate by putting his hands. Okay, and just to show you guys a couple things, uh, they, there's accessories in here. There's different blades that they can use. You don't really need to know how to put that together. The main thing is that there's even this little cone here that we could put right in here and the surgeon could put his um, bipolar cautery in there. All right, and uh, that's it. I'm gonna have, right now there is this um, book that's by the Mayfields and the Sugita, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna update that and uh, that's it.